Ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? My name is DJ A9ZT and we're back with WWE Champions in another 5 star silver character gameplay preview video. And today, we got Goldberg, the all new free MLC Masters of the Universe superstar. And uh, he is the, how do we say, the heroic human jackhammer. And uh, you can spin him around, but he's wearing steel and it doesn't really flip and flop, so... Let's go ahead and take a look inside the poster. He is a yellow gem trainer. And at 9k, yellow gems will do 2,200 more damage. Uh, links, he's got the Masters of the WWE Universe for matching any generate. Moves that generate any color gems will create two more any color gems. So that's pretty awesome. And if we look at his moves, the Gorilla Press Drop is the four-star move. And the Full Nelson Slam is the five-star move. All right, let's take a look at the moves here. So the first move set we're going to run three star move set. You will have all this unlocked at three stars. So we're going to run double green moves. We got the heroic human spine buster seven charge deal 35,000 damage and make five random gems into black gems. And we got the military press spine buster eight charge deal 46,000 damage and choose seven purple gems to swap to black gems. So that fills the board up with a bunch of black gems. We try to charge this, the heroic human jackhammer, 14 charge, deal 17,000 damage, and choose four columns to destroy. So we're going to hit the green moves. It makes a bunch of black. We hit the black move. Try to recycle the green with the columns if we can. So looking at the entourage here, I got George Steele. I got Titus. These two are going to be what we need for these green moves here. Uh, Titus is going to make more black gems, and Steel is going to start with more green move points. Then we got Jay Uso for 10% more green move damage. And I got DX Triple H on here for matching green gems charged by one extra move point, in case we need to recycle this a second time. But also, I got a strap here. I got a strap here. So the skill plate's actually going to be for uh, the next move set. So never mind the skill plate here. Uh,. I, I can't, like, change everything in between each moveset, um, but, so what I did for this was I built for him to use, to take advantage of the move damage metal for the green moves, and we'll take advantage of the skill plate for the red moves, so. I got a 50k green move damage takedown metal on there, I got a all gem damage 30% on there to go with that for the takedown bonus, then I got two fury medals on there for all gem defense and all moves defense so we got fury takedown combo and we got 30 percent gem and uh 50k on the green moves so let's get out here on the road match six SummerSlam tour book one hell mode against bray wyatt and uh let's give him that business here All right, he takes the helmet off, but he leaves the shoulder pads on. So let's go 11 random here. Now we're dealing 89,000 there. Nice spinning spine buster. I like it. All right, there we go. We filled up the black move right there. Boom. Bada boom. And he kicked out. All right. Choose 13 purple gems to swap to black gems. All right. That's 101,000 damage with that move damage metal on there. So, not bad. That's all we got for purple gems. Works well against Bray Wyatt here because he needs purple. So, let's go ahead here. Choose four columns to destroy. Okay, we need to get green gems and black, really. So there's two, two. That's six green. That's, uh, I think that'd be enough to refill the green moves. And we put some damage on the black one, too. There we go. So next turn, we'll be ready to hit him hard again. That was 428,000 there, even after the nerf. That might be it. Oh, he got lucky. He got lucky. All right, here we go again, 101,000. We're going to choose purple to turn to black here. Hmm. 
Hmm, maybe I had to leave that one as to not cascade yet. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm trying to hit him harder with this move. See what this one does. We're gonna chuck a bunch of black gems out there. Bop! Oof. There we go. What we get out of that? 734,000 damage there, y'all. That was a big time. Yo, absolutely destroyed him. Absolutely destroyed him. Yo, 700,000 damage is nothing to sneeze at, especially for a free superstar. So, whoo! That's actually really good. That's actually really good. All right, so now we got these uh we got these red moves that that's probably gonna be the best uh move set right there i mean i'm gonna swap out the moves and do another set but i want to emphasize that first set that's how i'll be running him from three star forward his five star move the full nelson slam seven charge black deal twenty six thousand damage decrease your opponent's purple gem damage by 79 percent for three turns that's yeah i don't know when i'm ever gonna use that and this doesn't flow fantastically. Um, the Gorilla Press drop destroys Silence Gems, but we don't use Silence Gems, so it's going to be specific to another opponent. But it does 72,000 damage, so what can you do there? Um, and this 5 charge here. So we got the Gorilla Press drop is uh, 9 charge red deal, 72,000 damage, destroy 9 random Silence Gems. We just talked about that. We got the other red move. Five charge, heroic human press, deal twenty four thousand damage. And choose ten gems to make into immobile gems, and then the finisher, the spear, eleven charge black, deal forty eight thousand plus ninety six thirty six bonus damage for every immobile gem and pin the opponent. So there is that. I mean, this other red move will do extra damage, but I don't even think that's going to be best because we probably want to make random black gems. So, because how are we going to fill the finisher if we use the gorilla press drop? I don't even know. So I might have to put that in. I mean, that's just destroying silence gems. I don't know. We're going to try and hit this finisher here, though, and see what it's all about. So let's, uh, we could still use Steel and Titus, really. Or I should be making more immobile gems. Let's do that. Or should I take the move point trainer off? Let's take the move point trainer off. Ah, it's Orndorff. I gotta get this dude to 5k. I gotta get this dude to 5k. Alright, so we could choose 13 to make it to Immobile Gems. I don't think I got any mobile gem damage over here. I never really looked for it, so I don't, I guess I don't know that for sure, but. Yeah, and that's leech damage down there. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think so yet. So we're just going to roll with it like this. We're going to go no move point trainer. We're going to see if we can hit that. But uh, I would think, personally, that's probably what you're going to want to use for like a hot tag situation. Maybe you bring Goldberg off as the second. Because I'm sure we have an immobile gem damage trainer. But we've got no way to fill the black move unless we can hit the green move too. So we need to do all of the above. And it's not going to be easy. Now, see, I don't think this was working. I had the Viper Strike plate on him, and I broke Black Gems last uh, match, and it didn't make the yellow into red at the end of my turn. So, we'll see. We're going to choose 13 Immobile and hope that we can keep him on the board. Now, I'm going to do that so I can break those.
Unbelievable. Alright, 11 random into black. Hopefully this doesn't blow up in my face. Hmm. Okay, let's see. Alright, it worked that time. But last match, when I hit the move that put all the black gems on the board, it, there was still a bunch of yellow gems at the end of it. So, I don't think it worked correctly last match. Uh, however, our red move is going to be ready just on time to hit him for a big finisher here. So, let's see what happens. And hopefully be able to hold him from most of his kickout damage here. All right, moment of truth. 52,000 plus about 10K for each one of those. And uh, 264, not bad. And he's out. And we're stuck now. <laughs> Hopefully, uh, the gem being immobile will help me out here. But like I said, I just wanted to try and hit this. I mean, you'd probably use the two red moves together for more uh, move damage. But it would take a long time to fill up that black finisher without using the green move with it. That first move set, though, that's definitely where it's at. Okay. Now this could take a while. And that finisher ain't hitting hard enough to really... It didn't hit hard enough to really necessitate uh, even use... Like, I can, I can fill all this again and it's probably still not going to hurt him. Now that he took all of my gems away from me. Of course he gets what he needs. Ooh, not bad, not bad. 477,000 damage. And survey says, good night. And that's it. That's it right there. So uh, that's all I really got for Goldberg today. That first move set. It's nasty. All right, I did like 700K there. So for a free dude, I'll take it all day. And I'm excited for Masters of the Universe month. So uh, get out there, build them Goldbergs up, and get to smashing people. And uh, if you're new to the channel, why don't you consider subscribing? There's a red button right down underneath this video player here. It says subscribe. Just click on it one time for me. And while you're down there, drop an insane elbow right down on that thumbs up button for me. Those things are free to you. And uh, it takes like five seconds. So why wouldn't you do that for me? It helps me out tremendously. So... Thank you, and until next time, y'all.